So what's up everybody? We headed out to the duck go this morning. We got old B up here driving away. What up, Parker? What's up? We headed out that way this morning. We finna go cook some breakfast right here and see if we can't get these birds to work a little bit. We got old Bootsy riding on the back back here. She's a little cold this morning. What do you think? No, What's the temperature out here, B? What? what? What temperature you got? We got 32 this morning. 32 this morning? Supposed to get down to uh, 29 by daybreak. By daybreak, 10 four. We headed back to a spot right here we had some pretty good luck on. We were gonna get Hartman right here to cook us some sausage and eggs, and a little bit of toast this morning. And see if we can't get something on the burn, and get us warmed up, and get us moving out here. What you think, Hartman? What you bring this morning? What you cooking on? We're gonna cook, gonna cook on the Blackstone again, uh, 17 inch. And we'll then we're gonna do some sausage. Yeah, think. Busy bringing sausage. Got sausage. We are loaded. Probably some coffee out there. It's cold. Like you said, it's gonna be. It was 36 when I woke up at 3:30. It's dropped several degrees, so it's gonna be cold. Boys, I hate old Cameron can't be with us this morning, but he's got to run a route this morning and one of the SRO members out. But hey, okay, like Cameron said, even if I ain't here, the show must go on, boys. So. That's what we're gonna do, the show is going to go on. So Cameron, this one's for you. We're gonna kill some ducks for you this morning, buddy. And hate you out here running around. We'll see y'all back whenever the coffee's on the burn. Third shell. Shoot my double stoker this morning. Got the SRO on that puppy. Let's hope that she knocks down some ducks this morning. We got old Bootsy girl ready. We set up on a on a creek run right here. We got about 10 minutes till shooting light and we got some birds coming in. We're gonna see if we can't get on them. Y'all stay tuned. Look at the feathers, big nasty. Got him, Curry, got him. <laughs> I gotta get that bird, he's trying to fly, hold it. Damn. Damn. Right here, hold on, I got two coming over, big nasty, right over your head, goes right now. Yeah, still got one of them.
that now. Got the cameras hot right here. We just want to let y'all know it is all B's fault that we ain't eat no breakfast this morning. Yeah. Yeah. Should have brought my own propane, I reckon. He left his brother at home, too. <laughs> left his brother. He forgot his brother. We're sorry, Brady. I know you don't know me, but. <laughs> sorry, Brady. You can come next time, buddy. You're supposed to be here. I'll tell you one, it won't be back. Not with the hopes of eating breakfast, any down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We got the big nasty up early this morning. I told him we was going to have him sauce, cheese, bread, egg laid out on the blackstone. All he's got to do is pull up, be, be hot. He jumped out and said, All right, boys, where's my plate? <clears throat> we was kind of like old John Wayne had a cold camp. Yeah. Sometimes millennials. That's what it is. Morning, good morning. Give y'all a little shot of the, the creek right here that we was hunting off of this morning. Now we was hunting down there on a lease down in here. Uh, but this is the, the bridge and the spillway right here. Imagine how many catfish fly across that thing right there. We've been very fortunate this morning. And uh, the chip taking us out here. We got this one right here, this bird. I'm going to let y'all see it. It's one of the prettiest wood ducks. I mean, that thing is, is flawless right there. It is a very beautiful bird. Now, Hartman shot him this morning. I mean, he just look at the green on the back of his head. see right here is the big nasty in his natural habitat. If you look going right here in his natural habitat. We got the big nasty in his natural habitat. <laughs> I think. Yeah we heard you coming about we 10 miles down down to the ride, so. What's up everybody? We're coming back to you this evening right here. We shot a hole this morning me and Daniel did and uh Daniel couldn't be back with me. So I got my son, and I got a uh, bee's little brother Brady, and I got the big next. So we all fixing to come right here and see if we can't get on these ducks. So what we expect these ducks to do, hopefully, 
is we just gonna catch them crossing right here. We ain't decoying, no calling, nothing like that. We shoot wood ducks, uh, really trying to call a wood duck of an evening. My opinion is about pointless. They don't really stop for much. And some people would argue that they won't stop in the morning times either, but I have seen them come in to decoy. Either way, we got some of the prettiest country you want to look at, and uh, we're going to be trying out my shot cam right here. I say shot cam. We're going to be trying out the tactic cam. It's worked pretty good so far. We just need to attach it to a man's gun that can actually shoot. Well, what you reckon, Doc? We're going to going to see if we can get after one. I got my main man right here. Tell him what we hunt. Hunt wood ducks. we we'll hunt some wood ducks. He got his boots, he got his britches, and he got his worn jacket on. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna give it a shot right here. We got a pretty good flyway right here, good crossing. Well, right, Swan and got doors. Right now, I got my first duck. Your first wood duck? My first wood duck. Drake. Drake wood duck. So, Doc, let me ask you this. How many times did you shoot at that bird? Three times. Three times? And which shot did you hit him? The first, second, or third shot? Third shot. The third shot, okay. Let's say first. We just put two in him for good measure. Cause you can make a lifetime of memories in those 60 days. Man, tell y'all the truth, we couldn't we couldn't appreciate <clears throat> Chip. Superior Pine Products, we thank y'all very much. This is a beautiful place to be able to come hunt. And uh, we appreciate y'all so much. Like I said earlier, if you're watching this video and, and you're looking for a good hunting lease, if you want to do some bear hunting, deer hunting, hog hunting, or some duck hunting like we doing, you need to look up Superior Pine Products. They have land available for lease and uh, it's some of the finest land you'll find anywhere. So make sure y'all check them out. And we thank y'all so much. And just give y'all a good look at this beautiful landscape we own right here this morning. Now, we didn't kill as many birds as we wanted to, but we did have a passel of birds coming over. I think we killed, how many we killed, B? Six? We shot a two-man limit this morning. But uh, what I was saying is the reason it was like that is we've got a lot of rain here lately. You can see this water just flowing. And what that does is scatters these birds out bad. When the creek's a lot lower and it's down in the banks, these birds just kind of confined to one area. And it's a whole lot easier to shoot them, but when the water's blowed out of the banks and it's flooded everywhere, it's just a hit or miss. You're either in the right spot or you ain't, you know? so. Thank the good Lord for letting us be here doing it this morning. And thank you for these boys right here being with me. Old Big Nasty, we love you, brother. And uh, we hope to do it again soon. And we appreciate y'all watching SRO, and we hope that y'all enjoyed as much as we have. So we love y'all. See y'all soon.